Begin CRM is so easy to use. When you access the home page, you'll find that you are in reach of everything that you want to make use of. So we're just going to look at a few things that you might want to make use of when you start up Begin CRM for the first time. So if you want to see your information about your subscription, your account, your email, and things like that, you come to your extreme right at the top there. Usually if the, your name starts with a certain letter, it's named after that or your company. So if you click it, you'll find that it tells you about your organization. If you have several organizations, you can actually switch from here. Your subscription. It also talks about um, the help uh, that you can get with help guide the community. Or if you want to talk to Zoho directly, you can make use of this. Secondly is the settings function. This is very important. You need to be able to quickly go to your settings next to that button that we talked about you click on that gear icon you have access to all the settings from user controls the organization workflows if you want to set up emails so that you can send them from your crm uh, and so many other things that help to set up the entire system to work well you access it from that section let's go back to the home page so these are the smaller button here helps you to get signals. There are certain things that you can automate to say, for example, if someone clicks the email that you uh, sent them, if they open it, you can get a signal to say someone has opened an email that you sent them. So signals come through this place and you can set them up in the settings panel. Also, these are the notifications, feeds, reminders, and system notifications are found in a very convenient place next to the settings button up here and next to the signals button it's very easy to access that so if you want to change any settings or to see notifications you come to your top right now there are different sections that you can make use within this uh software this begin crm if you come to extreme left you see you have your pipelines here so if you have set up your pipelines you can see them on your extreme left if you have so many of them, you can easily see them. You can also access your contacts. All of the contacts that are being fed from um, several sources or that you have typed, you'll find them in this section. If you have products that you're actually selling, you can actually make use of this product section. That's where you see your products. Sometimes you might have activities to say you might want to visit a client, you might want to call a client, you might want to prepare uh, something uh, for a certain process you can make use of activities here. So activities are more like a task area, which then is presented in a fashion of uh, a calendar. So you can easily add the information that you need by clicking there, say the plus sign, create a task, create an event, or log a call. This is how you make use of that. We also have dashboards, which are very important. You can access them from that section as well. And we're going to talk more about these in a different video. There are other accessibility functions that are there as well. For example, if you come to pipelines here, always at the top, you'd find that there is a button, a green button that's there that helps you to create uh, something that is within that section. For example, within the pipelines, you want to create a deal, you simply click this plus, or you can import deals or do so many other things. These three, uh, buttons also help you to have additional functions. You want to add tags or to approve deals, you can make use of that. Another function which makes everything easier is the ability to search uh, different parts of the software by making use of this search bar. So you can choose whether to search a deal in the pipeline, a contact, a company, a product, even a task can be searched. Or you can search everything by clicking all. After that, you also have the ability to add anything from this uh, section, which has this green button. It's like creating a record. So if you want to create a record in the pipeline, uh, in the contacts, company, any kind of record you want to create, you can create it from the home page. You don't actually need to go to the uh, contacts to create that. All you have to do is to click this green button and then create that contact. An interesting thing that we can also make use of, we're going to talk about it in the future videos is to make use of sub pipelines so we're going to talk about that later